Alright, this is going to be an LMS tutorial on how to make an 808 in triple oscillator. And if you're using an 808 sample, I have two other videos. One on how to make an 808 slide and another on how to tune an 808. First thing you're going to want to do is open triple oscillator. And once you open it, you're going to want to detune every single oscillator. And it should sound something like this, but you're probably going to want to use it in a lower octave so it has a more bassy sound, like in octave 3 it'll sound like this. And more than likely you're going to have some cracking, so what I would usually do is turn off oscillator 3, so then it sounds better. And after you get that, like, just kind of typical bass sound, you're going to want to go into your envelope and turn the amount all the way on and then turn off your hold, turn off your sustain, so then you have something like this. And then you just kind of manipulate the decay and the release till you get the bass to sound which, like you want to sound. So I'd want it to be shorter, just personal preference. And then to make it sound different, you can go back to plugin and turn some of these knobs, like detune this maybe, and tune that, and it will sound something like this. And then if you want to do an 808 slide with triple oscillator, it's kind of, it's the same exact thing as you would do in do with an 808 sample. So you'll just go into your piano roll and put it here and then click on detune mode. And once you click on detune mode, you'll click on a sample and wherever you want it to go up or down, you just kind of click there. For example, if I want it to go up when it's halfway through this bar, I would put that there and then put this here, and it should sound something like this. It would probably actually be earlier in... Okay, let's try this in a song. And then maybe something like this. Yeah, you get the drift.